reviewed this um, Bauman Living Bread Maker. So, this is an unboxing video. At the same time, eh, survey na din sa ating gagawin na first recipe. So, yung isa pong recipe is the wheat bread. So, para healthy option siya din makagawa tayo ng fresh bread. So, papakita ko sa inyo yung unboxing at the same time yung um, process ng paggawa. And right now, I'm just waiting for it na matapos yung pag -ibig. So, tara! So, here is the bread maker. This is the box. It is sealed. So, ayan siya. Naka-styro yung loob niya. And, ito yung with warranty certificate. So, ito siya. It also has a instruction manual. So, ayan siya. I haven't opened it yet. And, important reminder on how to take care of this product. So, ayan. So, here's the machine. Oh, no! Oh, no! 1.5 and 2.0 and then ito yung loob. Ayan. Oops, sorry. Nadumihan. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Ano ito, ikiklik mo lang yung unlock para matanggal siya. Yan. And then, may kasama na siyang um, blade ilalagay mo dun sa loob. Pang need. Tapos, may kasama na siyang manual. Then, sa manual, andito yung mga recipe. So, ayan. So, gagawin natin is yung wheat bread as requested by Sia. Yes, we will be needing 260 ml of water. 2 tablespoon of oil, 1 teaspoon of salt, 2 tablespoon of brown sugar, 2 teaspoon of milk powder, 1 cup of whole wheat flour, 2 cups of bread flour, and then active dry yeast. Once we have added all the ingredients, pantayin lang natin to. And then we can close it na. Here are the selections dun sa buttons. So, makita mo naman dito clear and very straightforward yung instruction niya. So, we're going to make use of wheat bread. So, number 3 yung program niya. So, yun yung piliin natin. Oops! Ayan. You can see in here all the 14 different functions. So from 1 to 14, I'm, I'm going to choose number 3 which is the whole wheat since yun yung finalo natin na ingredients. So for this one, so lagay mo lang yung, the thir yung third function. Nakalagay na siya doon yung number 3 doon. And then, dito sa next na button, um, to press mo lang siya kung 1.5 or 2 pounds and then ito is timer like for example you want to delay it the next morning you can do it like for 10 hours para fresh and mainit pa yung bread mo the next morning so pwede rin siya and then yung selection for the toast function kung gusto mo yung super toasted or yung gusto mo is yung sakto lang so pipili ka din dyan after that, um, so I'm going to uh, yung git na pipiliin ko. Then you can now press the play button. Makita nyo, yung kneading, yung rice, yung bread, and yung um, baking would take about three hours and thirty two seconds. So ayan na siya next start na siya magnead. Dito sa display monitor naman kung ano na yung nangyayari. So for this one, if you can see, need yung nakalagay ayan. So, okay na okay to kapag ka nag-work from home ka and all. Ito, ngayon, nag-need na siya. So, iwan natin siya syempre. Hindi natin hihintay yung 3 hours, 32 minutes. So, best to kapag marami kang ginagawa, iwan mo lang dyan. Then, maluto na yung bread mo. You can see, rice na siya. First rice. So, ito na yung second rice at 2 eighty. Sorry, nagpo-focus kasi siya eh. 
Now, remaining time is 1.44. Ito na siya. Nag-raise na siya ulit. So, finally, it's now on bake. So, ayan na siya. Nag-bake na siya. Let's open it. Ayan, medyo mainit na siya. So, pa-close ko. So, let's check it again. 36 minutes to go. Nag-bake siya. Uy, mainit siya. So, close ko na lang. Medyo mainit. Nag-auto-focus -auto yung ano. Hi guys! So, I'm back here at the kitchen. So, kaka-check ko lang. And yung time nito is 3 hours or more than 3 hours yung pag-bake ng wheat bread. And now, we are on the 35 minutes. So, nag-bake na siya. So, later, check natin ulit. Pakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung naging result. So, this is the first time that naginamit ko tong um, bread maker from Bauman. Okay, maluluto na yung ating bread and I'm just waiting for it. So, time three minutes na lang siya. So, let's just wait. And yun narinig din yung sa background si Sia. It's about sleeping time na yan. So, ayun. Update na. So, ayan. Um, warm na, auto warm na siya. Tumunog na siya kanina. And luto na. So, we're going to unplug it first. And then, we're gonna open it na. Nag-auto-focus lang yung phone ko. So, yan. Oh, medyo mainit siya. Eh, meron siyang kasamang parang hook. So, ito yung gagamitin natin. And then, we're just gonna unlock it first. So, ito twist ko lang to. So, first time, ayan. So, na-unlock ko na siya. So, be careful. Make sure na umamitin na ang parang pot holder. And then, we're going to use and put it sa ating pinaka parang, ano yun yung dry, drying rock. So, wait lang. Kuha lang ako. Nalagay ko lang siya dyan para mag-circulate yung air. So, ito na siya. Ayan, ang ganda. Wheat bread. So, tikman na natin after 25 minutes. So, palabasin lang natin yung pinaka-steam. Okay. Let's eat it now. Oh, I'm gonna do it. about this product is approved siya sa akin. First is um, very busy ako. I'm working from home and then I don't have yaya. So, kung gusto kong gumawa ng bread and I want it fresh, isili ko lang siya magagawa. Parang gumamit lang ako ng rice cooker kasi isasalang mo lang yung ingredients. Tapos less yung hugasin. Second is kasi obviously nasarapan si Sia dun sa akin nalabasan ng bread. May kipihikan kasi itong batang to. Pero look at her smile. Sobrang nasarapan siya dun sa bread. Yung texture niya tamang-tama. Hindi siya matigas. Hindi siya malambot. So kung ako kuha niya yung texture na hinahanap ko sa isang bread. Wala yung sama tong video na to while I'm giving my feedback kasi nagulat ako na si Sia is gumagawa or nagre-record siya on her own. So, ayun, um, nakatipid kami sa time and yung sa ingredients, you can use the ingredients na meron ka. You can easily source it out kung anong gusto mo, kung wheat flour, bread flour, tapos alam mo yung ingredients na ginagamit mo. Fresh siya and wala siyang halong preservatives. So, isa yun sa nakikita kong pros din naman yung wattage niya. So, I think matipid naman to sa kuryente. 
din, wala kang time magmasa ng bread or maghintay pa kung kailan magra-rice. I really advise you use this kind of product if mahili ka sa bread. Kasi diba, anytime, diba, kung gusto mo ng fresh bread, hindi mo na kailangang lumabas pa um, or maghanap ng fresh bread, especially with the pandemic that's going on right now. We want everything to be parang made at home na lang, diba? So, ayan, yun lang. For watching if you like this kind of video don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and also don't forget to hit the notification bell para updated kayo kapag na meron akong new video bye